Hi, my name is Sarah Pimentel and I'm the Studio and Membership Coordinator. Today we'll be going over the front end of the gallery website. This was launched in August 2021, so we apologize that it took a little while to make further instructions. So let's begin. So on our front page, clients are able to look for work that is in our current and past exhibitions. Here we can see our current exhibitions tab. And then over here, when we scroll down, we can see our past exhibitions. And this button over here on the right, you are able to scroll through our past exhibitions and see some of the work that we've had throughout the year. When you scroll down a little bit more further, you come to our virtual gallery. Here we display our current exhibition. Click on the play button to start the virtual reality tour. All right, and let it load. All right. And here you simply click and drag to pan and click on the circles on the ground to move around. Okay, let's continue. If we keep scrolling, then we can come to the search feature for clients to find certain artworks. So let's pretend I'm someone who's looking to buy a painting. I can select painting in the category and I'm looking for something that's between 5,000, well, sorry, 500 to $1,000, um, $1,000 to $2,000. And notice that I'm able to click on two functions at the same time and have them both selected. Then I would like to get a medium piece and a large piece, something like that. Um, I don't have a particular preference for style, so I can leave that unclicked. And for the subject, I'm gonna go with landscape and cityscape, for example. And we click on find art for sale. So here we're brought to a page with selection of work in the subject that I was looking for, but they're all different styles. We didn't select a certain style, so I have a variety of different styles here. Scrolling up, if you notice here, we have a section that at the top of the page narrows down my search. I can choose to have a different price range. I can choose a different style this time. I can choose a different category. I'm able to do any of these functions still while on this page. So let's select um, a random artwork. Um, let's go with this one here. So a pop-up window or a small window in other words will appear and display an artwork larger and show all the details of the piece that I selected. So we have the title over here, the artist's name, the dimensions, and of course the price right here. Clients can see all of this and can choose to add this piece to their cart right away to purchase it, or they can add it to their favorites. Scrolling down a little bit further, we have um, about the artwork. So we have a description over here, a little bit more about the artwork there, details and dimensions, shipping information, and at the very bottom of the page, um, some information about the artist. And here is just a brief overview of the artist, but we can see her full artist profile by clicking on this button right here. So here is the artist profile. The images are all customizable as is the bio and the quote you see here such as the banner, this is also customizable and the profile over here and the side image. Scrolling down, we can see the artist's recent exhibitions and under the featured artworks, you can see any awards and artwork received, such as this piece here that won third place. Below, we are able to browse all the artworks by this artist and these can be purchased as well. And it also displays artworks that have been sold. Just a reminder that this listing needs to be updated by you on your portal. Um, mentioning portal, to help us sell your work, please keep your profile updated and set your artwork for sale. Another reminder that all of these artworks have been juried and accepted into an exhibition. And there you have it. I hope this video was useful for you. Please don't hesitate to reach out if you need any help and thanks for watching.